July the 23rd, 2022 it is. A bit morning hours, but that's quite all right. This video is in respect to a recent issue I have encountered at the church St. Mary's Nativity at Tershka Gora. When I got assaulted at about 2 o'clock in the morning on July the 18th of 2022, therefore like five days ago during, doing, during my exercising up there in the morning, early morning hours, uh, in case if you have not gone through. I did mention, in fact translated the audio recording on how a grandson from the ex-police director of Novo Mesto uh, eventually attempted to even punch the telephone out of my hands. It, it wasn't about breaking the telephone only, and this is a very, very important issue for me to discuss. Uh, I have not clarified everything about this attack, also I did describe really well is the following information I'm going to use to supplement this claim against ex-director of Novo Mesto Police and his grandson. Very important for me to state. I have observed this grandson of ex-police director of Novo Mesto Police Director uh, practicing sports, soccer, and among others also, I was indirectly suggested by the people, guy is, guy was training boxing, he was training some kind of uh, fighting techniques for the sake of encounter years ahead. He became involved in this case at age 14. In his terms, age 14 would be sometimes in 2014, 2015. Very early, young 2015, let's say, uh, and developed the idea because of his grandfather to even engaged in a physical conf confrontation against me uh, at this location, at this very location. That's what I was promised. They at first did not want to have a physical confrontation, but grandfather was the one who pushed, consented with his grandson and have pushed further the police. Uh, it was something police had to do with the residence near by. However, I was also taught, promised, and it's something what I have seen later when descending down into a valley from this hill, from Tushkagara Hill, I have seen two police vehicles. Uh, one police vehicle patrolling residential neighborhood, another police vehicle was parked uh, at the parking lot of the Kirka Pharmaceutical. I don't know whether this intervention vehicles were the vehicles that would be eventually that were used as a setup on occasion. That's why this is very important for me to clarify that this was not just blah, 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 just something like this. But behind this, it was a police setup with clearly with intention to get me arrested that night. Uh, it was a pressure they exercised on me. Which involved the idea that I would even abandon location, maybe display some kind of panicking uh, not gonna say mode, 
but errors or something like this in, in a personality, some kind of a disorder or something like this. Police director, ex-police director Novo Mesto was concerned about his grandson's safety if the physical confrontation would develop, yet he was very much motivated and interested in a physical confrontation for no less than two years. He wondered about this meeting, forthcoming meeting, and have finally arranged through what he claimed is going to be a police vehicle in the vicinity, just minutes away, that will arrive, that will intervene in case of physical confrontation, a uh, few meters eventually park away from the scene. What exactly the chances are for me to obtain the information on police movement that night? Well, I don't have any, but chances are that police vehicle, according to MK Ultra scenario, was located perhaps just maybe 50 meters away from the incident. If not, maybe even inside of one of the homes that are in vicinity, just a few meters away, there is a possibility, such possibility too, so that at all costs, he would protect the life of his grandson in case something like physical confrontation would develop. This was definitely a physical assault, which attempt main goal was uh, to arrest me and obtain my recordings, my stuff, by Novo Mesto Police. The two vehicles, police intervention vehicles, I have encountered once I have descended the valley were far too far so that I could point out on those two vehicles. Uh, but I suspect, as I stated, according to what I was promised the case is going to be, there was more than these two vehicles uh, that operated at night. Maybe these two vehicles were in vicinity as well. I don't know how much Slovenian government has ability to look into uh, operation of this vehicle, vehicles for mentioned date for July the 18, early morning hours, but I deemed that there was a police just probably even a few meters away from the place of an incident. This definitely was video recorded. Uh, people from Chantiernay also told me under MK Ultra that it's this very issue, in fact, that I have to mention because they have obtained proofs about individual. They have recorded, video recorded, audio recorded, whatever the case might be, that he was taking a very serious preparations for a physical confrontation with me. He was literally preparing himself for a physical confrontation with me years ahead for this very occasion. So this is more serious than what one would even give credit in respect to already serious incident that took place in a very early morning hours of July 18 of 2022. Want to be clear about it, this was more than just uh, what I have translated, explained the other day, have taken place. This was a very serious uh, police attempt to get me in a lot of trouble. Date and time when this was video recorded. This was video recorded on Saturday, July the 23rd, 2022, in early morning hours. Unfortunately, I have a whole lot of work 
to do. This is Nargam MLS video for tonight. Thank you for watching this video.